All right, there we go. This video is going to help anyone that has a golden tee ball for uh, Silver Strike Bowling, Simpsons Bowling, a number of games that all have a track ball. You'll be able to rebuild the track ball or replace the track ball really easy. And don't feel so intimidated because it's, it's really simple. It's actually like a mouse on, the, on your computer at home. So I'm going to use my golden tee here, which thank you very much, uh, Incredible Technologies. They made a great game, golden tee. I don't work for them, but I don't mind endorsing these guys. Uh, I'm going to go up to troubleshooting. And you go into uh, player controls. Most games have an option like this. You can test to see if the trackball is working good. And it really only has two directions, left, right, left, right, up, down, up, down. That's an X axis and a Y axis. And between that, you can get all the different 360 degrees of motion. So there's two types of trackball. Um, there's the standard one that comes from a manufacturer here in Illinois called HAP Controls. And it's a HAP trackball. You might see it look like that. Then there's another great trackball called an Imperial trackball. And it'll look like a diamond. And it's just as good. They're both really good trackballs. And whichever one you have, they have replacement trackballs or they have replacement rebuild kits that you can use for rebuilding the trackball. The rebuild kits consist of only a few things you really need. They come with sometimes the shaft, which gets worn out in the middle there, will come with some new bearings. And then again, the shaft will come with the flywheel on it, which again, I'll go into later. You won't get the electronics, which is, there's two boards, an X and a Y board that read the axis. And those optos, I'll show you how to clean those out real easy. So, so remember screws to take this apart. It's really simple. And you can even do work on it while it's plugged in like I am. I took this one apart earlier, cleaned it out, and then I still have a brand new one I'm putting back in the, the game because I'm going to sell it shortly. But you just get yourself a can of air. So whether it's your rebuild, or the trackball you're working on, you just get in there and blow out all the dust out of the opto, and then make sure that it, it's running smoothly, sounds smooth, doesn't have a lot of ah, mechanical grinding noises. If you hear that, then you probably have some wear spots on those two shafts, and you might want to get a rebuild kit or a new trackball. Put it back together, plug it in and test it, and you'll be able to see. So this one's like new, random bearings, so it just runs smooth. You can hear it spinning still. Here, okay. So anyways, uh, do a few more videos rebuilding a computer to make sure it's clean, clean out the video card and such. And we'll do a really easy Coin Mac clean out video, which to me sounds simple, but I've seen it at so many arcades that are still running coins, it's ridiculous. So, anyways, we'll do a few more videos like this to help you guys fix your games and. Uh, Keep your kids happy during coronavirus, all right? Thanks.